Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Inkiwa. If you are new here and if you're returning, what's up, my G? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing my experience, my results from attempting to eat only salads for up to seven days. So if you're interested in that, you want to know what it was like for me, and you want to know the kind of results I had, you definitely want to stick around and watch this video till the end. <laughs> So first of all, I attempted this, um, I don't know whether to call it a challenge, but basically it is a challenge where you eat only salads for up to seven days. Strictly salad and nothing else. And I attempted this, or I felt the need to attempt this because I really wanted to test or push my discipline when it comes to eating. Let me be honest with you, I could be disciplined with every single thing in my life except eating. For example, there are days where I would wake up and I would say that I'm going to say fast for a certain period. If you know what intermittent fasting is, you know what I'm talking about. So I would say that I would fast for maybe 12 hours or maybe 6 hours for example. And I would not even complete my fast and I'll be having a whole pie and some donuts. Like that is how bad my discipline was with regards to what I was eating. So it just hit me and I decided that I was going to cut out every single thing and just be more in command of my body as opposed to letting my cravings and my feelings decide what I was going to eat or how I was going to eat. So that was my reason for doing this um, challenge. And so for seven days, I received a variety of salads from the salad bar GH. If you are regular on this channel, you know that I have um, a full-time job. So um, waking up every day and making a fresh salad or getting home late from work and making a fresh salad for every single day was something that I didn't think I wanted to do or it, it just didn't fit into um, my lifestyle at the time. So um, I partnered with um, the salad bar GH and they send me salads every single day for all the seven days. And my favorite thing about the Salad Bar GH is that now they offer um, these packages. So um, they have a five day salad package and they have like a seven day salad package. I'm sure they can have like custom packages. So if you want um, a salad every single day, for five days they can do that for you and if, if you also want it for say seven days they can do that for you and the price is so freaking low you'd want to check them out i'll leave a link to their instagram and their phone numbers in the description box i started the challenge on a monday as you'd expect new week new me all of that stuff so i started on a monday and um because i wanted to have just one meal which i would get into a little later but I decided that I was going to have just one salad, just one meal, like that is the salad for the entire day and I'm just going to repeat that for the seven days. So because I wanted to do that, I needed to fast to a certain period and then eat and then for the rest of the evening I do not eat so that I'll be able to go to bed properly or at least that's what I thought. So for day one I fasted up until i think 3 p.m well hello today is monday and it is day one of my challenge of my eating just salad for seven days challenge and my salad just came in i can't take my eyes off the box this is what it looks like how it like you know how salads usually come in bowls and stuff like that this one is a bit different or i think this is like box material and then there's very minimal plastic which i think is fantastic um, it's currently 11 52 and so it's not yet time for me to eat since i'm also doing intermittent fasting so i'm just going to put this in the freezer and take it out when it's time to eat it I was able to stay without eating and just drinking only water for the whole period up until three o'clock and i think that was just like the initial um i don't know what to call it like vim that you have when you start something and it was very satisfying the salad was really good then i got home on monday 
from work I, when I got home, I was a bit hungry, but nothing I couldn't uh, manage. And so for the very first day, the salad was the only thing I ate throughout the day. Then, day two. All right, so it is day two. Day salad is here. Again, in their very um, eco-friendly packaging. And it smells so good, and I love pear. There's pear in here. There's, I think this is shredded chicken. Yeah, shredded chicken, there's some eggs in here. So for day two, for some reason, I couldn't fast up until three o'clock. Like by the time it was one o'clock, I was starving. I just picked my salad and I ate it completely, entirely. So for the second day, because I ate my salad earlier than I did the day before, I was famished by 6, 7 o'clock in the evening. So um, I bought two eggs and I had that in the evening before going to bed. I don't know if you could call that a cheap meal because I could have literally just added more eggs to the salad and it's just so a salad. So I don't know. If you think it's a cheap meal, do let me know in the comment section and yeah, we'll see how that goes then day three day three i woke up hungry so again instead of um having my salad at three or one o'clock i had it at around 11 30 in the morning and again i was very hungry by the end of the day so i had two more eggs that day and then i went to bed by day four, I think my body was beginning to adjust. I wasn't hungry until about one, two o'clock. And then I had my salad and I went to bed that day. And then day five was a Friday. I had, the salad was so good on that day. It was a potato salad, so I ate all of it. Later that evening, I had um, pork chop which i probably shouldn't have packed but i did and then i went to bed saturday was hard and everybody in my house was eating because we're obviously not fasting and so on saturday um i had my salad i think around 11 o'clock and i went into my room just to take my mind off the fact that everybody in my house was tempting me with whatever they were eating um that worked for a bit until um, I think five o'clock where I had to have another salad. I had my last salad on a Sunday and um, that Sunday I had a few spoons of wachi. I'm just going to be honest and tell you that I did have a few spoons of my mother's wachi but that was it. So that was what my seven days looked like for this challenge. So now the question is will I do this challenge again if I had the chance to and my answer is a strong yes but which is a very big but just in case you want to do this these are the things that i learned from doing it so first of all i would not advise you to go from eating maybe three meals in a day or two meals in a day to eating just one salad meal in a day that was not a good idea you will feel the hunger pang. so i would advise that if you want to do this you start um, cutting down on what you're eating. So maybe if you're eating three meals in a day, you could start with reducing the portions of the meals you have throughout the day. Then you can step it up by replacing one of your meals with a salad before you finally graduate to having just salads in a day. Another thing I would do if I was doing this challenge is include more protein in my salad so that i'm more satisfied and you'll be able to sustain me throughout the day so before i started the challenge i took my measurements using a tape measure on i think on a sunday and i also took my measurements on the last day of my salad challenge and i used just a measuring tape because i have decided that for this um for this weight loss journey or this fitness journey that i'm on i am not going to step on a scale because a scale be messing with my feelings and so i'm going to show you my measurements from before i started the challenge and what my measurements were after the challenge <laughs>
so now that you've seen it um you can decide whether you want to attempt this or not i would say that i believe that the measurements would have been a little different if i just stuck to eating one salad a day and just calling it a day but of course i just went from eating two meals a day to two to three meals a day to eating just one a day so the hunger pangs and cravings were just very high so i couldn't stick to having just one salad a day also i'd advise that if you want to do this you do it from a place of loving I mean, where you're looking at it as giving yourself giving your body a break for example from all the junk and allowing it to rejuvenate or just giving yourself the nutrients that it truly needs as opposed to giving you all the sugars and every single thing that it probably doesn't need that much of and not come from a place where you're doing it because you absolutely dislike your body so yeah if you enjoyed the video you definitely want to check out one of these videos on my channel and give it a thumbs up if you liked it hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and check out the salad bar gh they would hook you up on all the amazing salads for the coolest price in town so if you want to attend this challenge definitely check them out and i will see you in one of these videos